Hello everyone, my name is PJ and this is my friend Tyler and this is 2P, 2P Crash, Crash Bandicoot. Bandicoot Part 3. Okay, yep. so between this week and last week, I actually did try a few of the levels. It took a long time to actually master some of the levels in order to get the gray gems. But I got a few of them. I forget how many, like four or five. But I was in the middle of this stage and I was getting the Embryo tokens and I just got the third one. So I didn't want to show what happens when you get the, all three tokens without recording it. So I made a save state and stopped. After this though, I'm going to go back and show you some of the secrets that I found. Yep, and we're going to have a lot to go through, for sure. Yeah. So, third Embryo token. Yeah, bonus round. I learned something about these bonus rounds. What? For starters, their crates do not go toward the box total for getting gems. Okay. And you can only play each bonus round once, whether or not you win. Oh, that was close. That was quick. Wow. Way to go. <sighs> oh well, doesn't matter. The whole point of me being here was to collect all the boxes anyway. Because every time you get a gem, it lets you save. So you don't get so, any, so you don't get anything from the embryo bonus stages. Well, you probably just get the save. Are you sure? Maybe extra lives too. Should I look it up? All right. <laughs> it's it's best if we find out what they give. Your extra lives and achieve a sense of accomplishment. Okay. Yeah, that's it. All right. Yeah, and like I was saying, you can save your game after collecting gems anyway, so you don't even need the bonus rounds to do that. Okay. I it just it just baffles me that they would have multiple types of bonus rounds, and it said there also there was uh what neocortex bonus rounds. So whatever those are about. Uh, I think they're only like in the end of the game. You know, I need to make absolute certain that I don't die because I got this far without dying. The first time. Well, yeah, because you'll get you'll get something at the end of the stage if you do it without dying, right? The gem. Yeah. yeah. I need to get back into the groove. I, I wish killing the first bat just got rid of the entire stream of bats. I have no idea why they have to do both. Do checkpoint boxes count towards your box count? Yes. Okay. Every box counts, including TNT. Yeah. So apparently. Uh, nitro crates are in this game. That, that that's kind of surprising to me. Or if they are, we just haven't seen them yet. No, I think they I think they were introduced in the second game. Yeah, and that special block at the end of the stage is that destroyed them all, since you don't want to be running into them. Yeah. Uh oh 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 oh. Okay, so be careful. Close. Every single time we get that one. Every single time. It's like the closest thing imaginable. Alright. Um. Oh, jeez. Wow. <sighs> this is really nerve-wracking. <laughs> yeah. Because if you die, you're, you're just done. And, and that's something another thing we have to do off-camera. Alright, well, at least this isn't so bad now. Now that you're down here. Yeah, just don't, don't rush yourself too much. You should be okay. All right, there we go. Checkpoint. At least you don't have to kill all the enemies. That would be an annoying thing you'd have to do if they had put that on top of everything else. So, uh... Yeah, we've already seen this stage, so there's not really much to say about any of this. Kind of wish I did have more to say. And I see you have a mask, too. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> Um, I did have someone tell me, though, that, you know, you can save yourself from being pushed by those. If you just jump and hold up, you'll go back into the space in the back. You could save yourself. Yeah, that so, makes sense. Yeah, keep that in mind. That you oh, could, well. Yeah. Now I just gotta finish the stage. Yeah. I mean, I had to do it anyway, because I... I had to do the stage over again anyway, because there are some secrets in the stage I wanted to show. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, yeah, because you can't, you can't spin those. I was hoping that he would jump, like, around the same time as the block comes out. They just walk around? Yeah. Walk under him. Yeah, because I assume that, like, you got... Yeah, because you, you got the gems, but have you actually taken any of the gem paths yet? No. No, okay. No, you don't... You don't, you don't get any of the colored gems until later levels. Okay. And so. most of the levels with gem paths are in the beginning of the game. Okay. 
<laughs> you need to jump on that one to hit that. <sighs> yeah, you do. It's... I I tried to do as much uh, live life farming as I could. Yeah. Lives stop appearing in stages after certain conditions are met. Well, yeah, you're hitting checkpoints or. No, I mean even if you go back to them. Oh. So you're kind of stuck with just whatever lives you get, and that's it. Yeah. Well, that's not so bad. I mean, it's not as though dying is a gigantic penalty, especially if you have saves in the right places. Um, just apples? Okay. Yeah, wumpa fruit. I know they're called wumpa fruit, but they look like apples. Or mangoes, something like that. Passion fruit? Oh, well. What is a passion fruit, anyway? I have no idea. Why is there grapefruits and grapes? Because aren't grapes a fruit? Aren't bananas, aren't bananas berries? I don't know. Why are you asking these questions? I assume you know things. Anyway, up the creek is one of the stages I got a gem in. Yeah. yeah. Remember how you were, like, convinced that there was a secret to one of the waterfalls in yeah. this stage? There is. There is. Oh, I was right. Okay. What was there? Well, you're going to well, find out, I guess. Yeah, I'm going to show you. And I did not look this up. I found it out on my own when I was confused by something. Come on. I can't believe I was actually right about something. That's amazing. I'm really proud of myself. I love the music in these little areas. It's so calming. Watch out for the death monkey. Yes, I'm aware of how the monkey works now. So you just wait for it to like beat its chest? Okay. How do those things even go upstream? Seriously. Must be like tons of water vortexes or something. Whirlpools. Water tornadoes? <laughs> Is it the next one? Yeah, I think so. Uh, do you remember that um, exclamation point steel box that you kept dying trying to hit? Yeah. Yeah, did you ever wonder what that was for? Oh, it was. It had to go back? Uh, I knew there was something, though, and I can't believe I was right. Yeah, um, there you go. Still, I wonder what it is, though. So as we'll find out. Yeah, this area. I just assumed that it was for something later, but... All right, there we go. And then we gotta wait for the lily pads to come back. And underneath the waterfall, ah, a bunch of lily pads to protect you. Although it's dangerous to try to jump on them. Yeah. Perspective is really skewed here. So instead, what you do is you just come down here, hit this TNT crate, and then bounce on this to get back up. Okay, so it was just a crate. Okay. Okay. Yeah, then you can finish the stage. No wonder that's how he missed, like, the one box or whatever. Oh, okay. That's sneaky. I know there's also a part in the game where there's, like, a, a wall you have to walk through or something. That's in two. That's in two? Oh. Yeah, that's after a hallway full of nitro crates. Okay. So no fake walls in this one, I guess. Right about one thing, wrong about another. I'm sorry of my life. Well, I mean, all we really had to do was show off that. I mean, I'm not really sure why you're still going through the stage. Because I want to keep my lives... That I earned from the Wumpa fruit. You can't just exit the stage? I think it might undo your progress if you just exit the stage. Uh, hmm. and besides, the exit right, right there here. anyway, yeah. We're, we're right there anyway. Yeah. We'll be okay. Alright, so what are we actually on now today, stage wise? Uh, well, that was the only real secret I had to show off, apart from the one in the Lost City. Uh, I'll show that off real quick and just leave the stage. Okay. If you can. It's right in the beginning. It shouldn't be difficult at all. What What, what is the uh, secret, though, here? I didn't know there was one. Yeah, I'll show you. It's not something you would have ever, like, noticed right away. Okay. Without carefully examining the bit. Carefully examining the area. That was close. So remember when you turned all, turn all the bats there the first time? That was awesome. Okay. You see this crate right yeah. here? Yeah. This bouncy crate yeah. that doesn't have anything visible above it mm -hmm. that you just span into. Mm -hmm. You couldn't hear it, but we hit an exclamation point box. One of the steel ones. Oh, we did? Yep. 
And that made that box there visible. Okay. And that's how you get this embryo token. All right. Okay. Good. Now I can actually move on with the game. Yeah. And I'll do more gem hunting between episodes. Mm-hmm. Okay. We're on Sunset Vista. Or Vista, or whatever. Windows Vista? Okay. So, this uh, doesn't look like a Sunset Vista to me. This well, looks like a temple. It's Sunset. So that's something. There's probably some more secrets in here, probably. And uh, this will probably be another uh, painful experience, filled with much misery. But I'm prepared. Or well, at least I can finally start finding extra life boxes now. They said, well, we, we kind of know how to handle this now, so... Oh, you're good. All right. Lucky you. They do have, have that be awfully close, though. You all 37 lives? Okay. I didn't see that the first time. You did a pretty good job of running for lives. Oh. Okay. What are you hanging on? Yeah, see, that's the thing. Yeah, some of them just float. It's really weird. Like, I think they're supposed to like look like they're part of the tree, but like that one is obviously just floating in the air. If that was the case, couldn't they have just made a little flying one, just in, like in place or whatever? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Good, good. You're winning. I believe in you. Well, I had a lot of practice trying to beat those stages without dying. <laughs> it's the, They give you so many lives. It's so funny to me. I like the background here, though. The weird tree pillar things. Tree pillars. Or are those stone? I think those are stone. Oh, I thought they looked like trees. That shouldn't be too hard. Yeah, I probably want to go back there. Yep. Oh. Oh, what? Jump. Oh! 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 Really? They put like the crusher walls. The pusher wall, should I say. Uh... Oh, hey, we got use out of it. Good. I was uh, worried there that it would just be. Useless? Yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, God, it's so funny how, like, there's, like, no characters in this game. Because I, I keep thinking of, like, how much character they give, um,. Uka Uka in the later games, you know? But in here, he's like... You mean Aku Aku. Aku Aku, sorry. And how... Because like, they give him, like, no no personality at all in this first one. He's just there. Oh, he doesn't even get dialogue into the third game. Huh. Oh, come on. So where is Coco during the events of this game? I think she is in Cortex's lab. Because... Uh, I did some research into the actual story of this game. Yeah. You know, research is necessary for this game. Yeah. Uh, all of the anthropomorphic characters in this world were created by Neo Cortex to be his servants. It's just that Bandicoots, for some reason, seem resistant to his mind control device, which is that Vortex thing that he was being loaded into that rejected him. <laughs> Wampa fruits have purple insides? Yeah, they're rainbow colored. They have warm colors in the outside and cool colors in the inside. I had no idea. Wh what? What the fuck? What happened? I don't know. I just stood on air for a second. That was a weird glitch. That made no sense. Well, try and jump on it from, all, like, right atop the uh, the flame spitter. Yeah, there you go. Ridiculous. <laughs> he almost fell off there. Oh, jeez. Did we miss some of those? I don't think so. This is weird to get one so late in the stage, isn't it? We might not be late in the stage. Yeah, that's one of those bad ones where you fall down you just gotta do the whole thing over again. Oh, 
There was a manga for Crash Bandicoot, right? Yeah. It was weird. <laughs> in the manga, uh, it explains that the reason Tana isn't in the sequels is because she left Crash for Pinstripe. Really? Yeah. Really? Uh... So, God, she pulled a crystal fox, really? Wow, okay. <laughs> That's just too perfect. I still can't get over how perfect that is. Oh my god. That's not so bad. Yeah, just wait until... Yeah. Oh, okay. no, they're, they're offset. Oh, wait. No, you're good now. You're good. Oh, Oh, you're still good! Thank God for fire and asks. <laughs> nice. Oh, and they give you another mask to make up for it. How nice. Wow. See, this proves you're getting better. No. Mm. Oh. Why don't I go forward? God damn it. Bad controls? Well, not bad controls, just iffy controls. What, what's over there? Oh, it's a bat. Okay. Didn't see that as a bat at first. That kind of just like a part of the wall. What's with the right? It's nothing. It's just an invisible wall. I wonder what these maps look like if you zoom all the way out on them and just see the entire thing at once. I wonder if there's any. What? What? Wait, why did Wumper Fruit show up over there? Can you go over there now? Uh. Why don't you go down and try? Uh, it was so it's it's looped side to side. So you killed it. You killed the bat on that side. And it dropped fruits on that side. Okay. But see, that's weird to me because that reminds me of the way Mega Man. Well, no, no, not Mega Man. Metroid One did things where like they they have either vertical scrolling or horizontal scrolling, and they couldn't do neither. Like, they couldn't have one that's neither. It's kind of kind of reminds me of that in a weird way. At least there was no glitch that time. Have I died yet? No. Wow, really? Yeah, you've been you've been good. You haven't died. Because they've been nice enough with masks in this stage. Amazingly. Oh, 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 oh. This is uh, bad news bears right here, man. Okay. Checkpoint. Oh, okay, oh, you're supposed okay. to use the checkpoint box. No, no, no. I can get this guy. Oh, here. okay. Good, good. <laughs> Hidden Aku Aku mask right here. Yeah, in the ruined city level that I was just at. Yeah. Oh, there's a Cortex token. Yeah. So this is one of the two levels that has them. Yeah, but in the ruined city levels, um, there's a part with two platforms that rotate in a circle. And if you wait until one of them's at the top of the screen and jump, there's a mask up there off screen. Oh, uh, okay. How is it fair to hide things off screen? That's not fair. At least hiding it in the background, like a little bit in the back, where you can see it with a very specific camera movement, that's at least fair. But it's not fair when they do it otherwise, because then, like, what's the point? Why the heck are you even doing it? Uh... That was a long stretch of bats. Yeah, bats do tend to uh, swarm. Swarm. Hmm. Well, you should be able to time this all right, right? I mean, they, they don't come very often. Oh, I had to time them and the fire. There we go. They're, they're a little bit generous on the timing there. So what's this one? Is this just... All four go at once. Okay, so and, yeah, and just... just... Gun it. Oh, 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 okay. Um... Oh... You got one shot of here. Got one shot. Luckily, now that we know we don't need... Oh, no! Oh, you didn't do it! <laughs> oh. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, well. Yeah, just get to the end of the stage now. We, we, we are never going to get one of these on, on camera, I don't think. Ugh. It sent me all the way back here. But that was where the checkpoint box was. Do you expect it not to take you someplace where the checkpoint box wasn't? I, I do. It is kind of neat how you can see 
uh, Cortex's lab a lot better now. Like, it's a lot bigger in the background. That's kind of neat. Is it? Aren't we on the same island as the ruined city? Well, we're on a different side. Wouldn't that still mean we're technically closer? Uh, well, it seems to think that I still have it. So that's good. Oh, uh, the, uh, the... Cortex token? Okay. Yeah. So you still have your tokens, but... Now, how does this work? Hmm. So you're nope. supposed to rush in there and then go, yeah. No, right, screw it. I'm just gonna cheap it. No, no, not like no, that. That's good. You were good. All you had to do is just hold right. Oh, really? Yeah. So hold right. You're good. See? Oh, no. there you go. See, it worked. <laughs> Okay. Back to two life points, at least. Or three life points, I guess, technically. What are you talking about? Because he leveled up once, so you get three hits now before you die. Hit point, Life points? Leveling up? What are you... It's, I'm talking about picking up the mask. I know, but those are some awfully unorthodox terms for them. Well, that's certainly what's happening. I mean, you're totally leveling up, Aku Aku, aren't you? He's getting stronger. He's learning new abilities. He'll learn Cure in two more levels. You shut up. <laughs> Can I go back there? Well, it's not my fault. He's... No. Okay. Why wasn't there a Crash Bandicoot RPG? I would have played that. Wasn't there? Like, on the Game Boy Advance or something? There was those crossover games with with, uh, with uh, Spyro, but those weren't RPGs. Okay, welcome out. Sonic had an I'm RPG. Guessing. And, all, and all, all I know about that game is that Big was one of the best characters, which is funny. Still, we're making progress. And I've only died once. Not that it matters. No, because we've already lost the chance to... And we got a chance to save. Which is good. At least now we know we don't have to worry about collecting any of the boxes. We just have to get to the end. And now I'm just starting to wonder, like, why... <laughs> Bragging rights, I guess. Okay, that one was really easy. Ta-da! 40%! 40% complete. <laughs> That's a lot more than... Yeah, 4 out of 26, 16 out of 32 levels. We still got a lot of levels to go. We're only halfway through the main game. Yep. And I still gotta go back to all the stages and get all the gems. Well, halfway through on three episodes isn't too bad. No, I think the Neo Cortex tokens are for getting the keys. So. Uh, where do you even use the keys, though? Is it someplace at the end of the game? I'm not sure. I never beat this game 100%. But you beat it basic percent, so like, shouldn't didn't there be a part where we see like locks or something? No. Because oh. I think there's a door, and the path to the door can only be reached um, if you have every gem in the game. Just to like appear and make a path for you. Because that's the only gray gem path in the game, and you need all of them in order to make it appear. To, or in order to complete it, that is. Yeah. And the only way to get all the gray gems is to get the colored gems, too. So it's one of those things that just kind of adds on top of each other? Just to get the colored gems, you need the red gems. To get the gray gems, you need this. And to get the keys, you need that. And blah, 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 blah. The game is surprisingly deep for what it is. Can you go around back? There? I don't know. I suppose I can. Well, I think you'd have to jump out at the end there. Just go go to the right. I think you have to go around there. At the end of the hallway. There's a wall there. There? No, there isn't. Do you see it? Wait, wait, where's, the, where's the wall? I don't see a wall. Well, if you come over this way, you can kind of see. There's no wall. Those are oh. two pillars. But either way, I don't see anything back there anyway. So it doesn't matter. Well, there's the end. Oh. oh, lucky you, I guess. Kind of took me by surprise. So... Where's that token? The last... It must be really well hidden. 
last cortex token. Yeah. Nope, there it is. Uh, no. Oh, wait, no, that was a that was life, oh, yeah. Okay. So, yeah. Uh, uh, where did I miss it? So, there must be a hidden thing somewhere in the stage. God damn. Well, I got over 50 lives, that's cool. Alright, my turn. Take your bets, how many lives will I lose? Oh, I should make a save state on the world map. Go ahead, do it. Isn't there a button for it? Yeah. There. Oop, there we go. Oh, they're gonna see that. Oh no. Oh no, it's cheating in a video game. Oh no. Oh, it's a boss. Uh, this guy, this guy. I, f I forget what he does. Koala Kong. He throws things at you. Um. I think you had to spin to knock those rocks back. Is that what I gotta do? I think. I'm trying to. Yeah, okay. Okay. Well, that didn't work. Yeah, just avoid the TNT. Only the slow moving ones can be deflected. Oh, okay. The I rest see. of them, you just keep yourself from getting hurt by spinning. Oh, he. he, he. Oh, yeah, you gotta watch out for the minecarts, too. Okay. Yeah, again, completely unimpressive boss. Big big bar of koala can't do shit, man. My timing was bad. When he when he stumbles around with his legs, it means he's gonna do the slow one. So yeah, yeah. Don't spin too early. Why does that protect me? That's so strange. I mean, I don't think spinning into rocks would really help me that no, much. Slow one. Okay, well, I'm I'm trying to retime it, but the timing is very difficult for some reason. Yeah, it's like Dark Souls attacks. It just had this longest startup time. Yeah. Those are playing Dark Souls too. Oh, it, oh, it lands on the ground. Okay, so then I can hit it after that. Okay. All right. Well, this, this guy definitely will not take fifty lives to beat. We're not going to be here for fifty lives. I beat Rip Roo. Come on. By the way, one thing we never actually mentioned was that I have a new webcam now. Yeah, we never so did. So, if I look different, then that's the reason. Yep, it's in glorious 1080p now. It might take me a while to configure it to exactly where I want it, though. Get my lighting straightened out. Yeah. I was distracted because I was looking at your face. Your beautiful 1080p face. <laughs> Is that beautiful, too? <laughs> in some senses. Come on! That wasn't even close. I'm better off just jumping out of the way. It's a lot easier than spinning. Well, no. I take that back. Okay, one more shot and then you can take over. Because maybe I just have no luck with Bara Koala. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. That's one out of four. He has four HP. Come on. I like the crystals back there. They look green. Even though they're just an alpha texture. Oh, 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 oh. Is that close? Oh, okay. It stays there for a long time. I don't think it goes away. I think you just have to hit him without the minecarts getting in the way. Oh. How did you do that? Oh, you got hit. Okay. Yeah. Just the explosions drowned out the sound of Crash's screams. <laughs> I could just let this one hit me, but no, I'm not going to do that. Okay, so here comes another heavy throw. Alright. There we go, we got him. Yeah, Crash Bandicoot. Now, oh, the next slash. Now, here you go. Here you, go. Here you take it. No, I've been playing for a while. Okay. Oh, we're on the third island. Third island. God. Finally. Heavy machinery. This game, this level is painful. How many isn't islands it? are there? Four? Three, I think. I think this is the last island. Might be wrong. Might be wrong. I'm, I'm just guessing. Yeah, because now we're starting to get into like the industrial stages. Okay, we do the. Remember not to touch those. They'll freeze you. 
They do? I thought the ice ones were, were safe to touch. I didn't think either of them were safe to touch. Well, I'll test it. I mean, it's not like I'm going to be able to beat this with one life anyway. Well, no, I'll try. I'll give it a, I'll give it an honest shot to, like, try and not get... See? Oh, okay. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, wait. Is there something down there? Oh. That is really tempting. Oh, God damn it. Ah. Okay, we're going. Yes! <laughs> okay, I was lucky. I was lucky. <laughs> they put those enemies there specifically to lure you in. Yep. Okay, and this takes us back up. Ugh. Gamer intuition, man. It helps us sometimes. <laughs> That's a weird, like, little <laughs> musical cue. Oh, shit. Well, so much for that. <laughs> so much for that. Now, get ready for failure. It's coming. It's coming in droves. Again, we'll come back to it. We did agree we'd be doing that, so. Yeah, I wonder why the ice doesn't doesn't hurt you. Whoops. Why can't you jump on top of those things? Because they don't have spikes on top, yeah. But they're machinery, so, you know, how can you hurt machinery with your fists? I didn't see anything about hurting them, just bouncing off of them. Okay. I mean, they're dull. This has to stop. I was spinning! I was spinning! I was spinning! Gosh, why is that so... My hands are getting so sweaty! Ah! A oh, wetness! It looks like we're getting to the point where you're just going to have to handle the rest of the stages on your own. I'm a non-entity now. Just I, I'm just going to blend in the background and hide now. I don't deserve to be here. I'm still here. I noticed. Why are they frozen, though? Why can't they just look like normal pipes? Hmm. Yeah, because frozen does make you think like it's a threat of some kind, but that was quick for an embryo token. Weird. And that, little, that little tang, a little music tinge or whatever. More of my stupid words, right? Um, it reminds me of uh, the uh, Splatoon soundtrack. Very, very similar mu like music. It, it reminds me kind of like... Come on, spin it. It kind of reminds me of Hideki Naganuma's work. That's a name I'm not Jake sure. Radio. Got it. I totally knew who that was. Oh, God, where are some great musics from that? We should play some of that music. Because it was so great. Wasn't there one like about the Mario Brothers? I'm pretty sure there's a song about the Mario Brothers. Not that I've heard of. Yeah, I think it's in I think it's in the in the original game they mention like about Mario and Luigi saving the princess or whatever. Yeah, I'll show it to you later. We'll find it. Sure that was Naganuma, because there are a few different artists on Jack Gun Radio's soundtrack. Well, maybe it's a different artist then. Were they just like different Japanese pop bands or I think so, yeah. Okay. Although Rob Zombie had a song on there. Pop zombie. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Did you know that um, the American version of Jet Guy, uh, Jet Set Radio? That's the, no, Jet Grind Radio is the first one, right? Um, in Japan, the game was called Jet Set Radio. In America, it was called Jet Grind Radio, and then the sequel on the Xbox was Jet Set Radio Future. Okay, well, Jet Set Radio, the first one. Um, did you know that the uh, the stage that takes place in New York was actually added to the American version later? Like, that wasn't in the original Japanese version. I just thought it was a little interesting. Yeah, and, that, and that character with the boombox, you know, the black guy with the huge boombox? Yeah. He was, he was original to the American version. He wasn't in the Japanese. Hmm. Yeah. Although I think they got, like, an updated version later that added them in the Japanese version. Like, they do with all yeah. the Kingdom Hearts games, yeah. Final Mix. Yeah. The quote-unquote international versions that only they get. <laughs> well, didn't um, Final Fantasy X International, wasn't it still completely in Jap completely in, Amer in uh, English, so you could still technically play it? I don't know. I thought only the voice acting was in English. I Again, I was I was just making a guess. I don't really know. Because I know a lot of people still play International X, like the classic version. 
Even though it's kind of unnecessary since we have... Well, we have it now with the HD remaster. Yeah. And Kingdom Hearts 1.5 and 2.5 and all them. Yeah. Yes, yeah, Kingdom Hearts 3DS never got a, like, a Final Mix version, did it? Have I died yet? Myself? Well, I think... Does it matter if you... If you died, yes. Well, I died, so yeah. You haven't died, no. I, I, no, I was just asking, because this is a really easy level. I could probably come back and get the gem for this stage. No, thanks for making me feel inferior. No problem. No problem, man. You know? Yeah, you've always been here for me, so I really do appreciate it. Maybe someday I'll be as good as you are. Or not. Yeah, probably. Come here. Come here. Why are you doing that for? Yeah, yeah that's kind of close. It's fine, though. God, you are so fucking sweaty, though. Jesus. I can't help it. I've been <laughs> like this my entire life. <laughs> There's nothing I can do about it. And if I get showers, I become more sweaty. Really now? Yes. But that's the exact opposite of what a shower should do. I know! Just get a cold one. I hate cold showers. Yeah, but they wake you up and they make you feel great. Well, until you're taking it. Then it, then it feels horrible. But then afterwards you feel great. Because <laughs> you know how when you only get out of the shower and then like the... Oh. Really? Why does that kill you instantly? Well, I guess it's like highly pressurized, heated air. But I was in the edge of it. It was like fumes at that point. Oh, uh, well. Gosh, it's okay. Our love and compassion for one another will bring us through. I highly doubt that. Isn't that how, like, anime rules work? Uh, no. Isn't it always justice? Isn't it always justice that saves the day and <laughs> inspires them to do good? Well, I mean, have you, have you... Okay, well, yeah, I guess, I guess friendship's more the Sentai rule. I guess. The power of humanity! And then Kamen Riders just, like, kick the fucking asses out of everybody. That's Kamen Rider rules. <laughs> okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, go back. Because I think you can go down there. Just saying. You already died once, why does it matter? Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> I honestly thought that. I honestly thought that. I was right twice already. Come on, give me give me the benefit of the doubt here. It looked like it, didn't it? There were no hints that suggested that you could. Not like with the other one. Plus, they already did that once in this stage. It'd be too predictable if they did it twice. Well, I mean, it wouldn't be cool if they put all the embryo tokens in areas like that in the stage. That could work. Uh, but I already have two. Yeah, what? and the first one was in the drop-down place. Yeah, but one of them wasn't. Okay, well, now we know we can just go right. Oh, oh, what? oh okay. Oh, oh. Fascinating. Oh, no! I couldn't get on top of the box to get it. <laughs> oh, that was, that was terrible. Oh, well. It's a shame there's no wall jumping in this game. There's no wall between any crash. Game. I know. Th mm -hmm. That looked like a trap. That was weird, but it wasn't. Okay. Wait, can I stand on those? Yeah. Just when they're not, just when they're flamed, they're, they're dangerous. Oh, no! 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 That was fire. That that burned you. Oh, it's all the way back here. Oh uh, no! That was that was bad. Crash is allergic to heat. That's why I always wear your safety goggles with goggles, kids. Yeah, I, I'm just here for moral support now. Do you got the rest of this game on your own? I don't know. <laughs> I'll fight Pinstripe. You're just trying to get uh, fruit for lives, I assume. There we go. Actually, got the mask. That should help. If we can find a third one. There should be a live in there, but nope. A life. Live alive? Is that supposed to be? Is that supposed to be live alive? I, I think it's about. Really? 
Did you not get a checkpoint? Oh my gosh. You knew I was on it because it moved me. Then I fell. I guess you were too close to the center point. <sighs> oh, now you're getting frustrated. <laughs> here, here comes the, the uh, quiet inner angst and anger. Let it froth up within you. Maybe you'll be able to breathe fire or some shit if you do it enough. Oh, I forgot to mention, also in that that Miitopia game I was telling you about earlier, the new one that just came out, some of you guys might know about it. Um, my town mayor ended up being Bendy. That was my town mayor. <laughs> and the stuff people make on, uh, on uh, those Nintendo games, man, it's crazy. Is Bendy still being made? Yeah. What episode is it on? Uh, last chapter I'm aware of is just, like, two, I think. Huh. Oh, this is tricky. This is tricky. SSX tricky. We should play that, too. Nah. Why not? The snowboarding game. It's fun as crap, though. It's got super over-the-top tricks. Found a third one. How dare you say snowboarding games aren't fun? Next you're gonna say Tony Hawk isn't fun. I'm not gonna say anything. It wasn't my fault. I have to entertain our audience. Never gonna figure out what's at the end of those stages. Are they just bragging rights? Give you a little trophy? Oh yeah, just extra lives. But I want to see if he's standing there. Wouldn't it be funny if we give you like, take this uh, this certificate to print out like the little computer games? Oh, that'd be funny. Oh, those things. Oh, there's a life over there. I, I happen to remember some one of those like weird kids activity centers on the computers. One of the ones I really liked was the Timon and Pumbaa one. Did you ever have that one? Oh, I had that one. Yes, I loved that one. That one was so good. I, I loved its unique take on tic-tac-toe. Yeah. Or after it's a draw, you can like move the pieces around like a checkers game. Draw and win. I think anybody who watched Lion King probably loved Timon and Pumbaa. Especially, it's, yeah, any kid would love those too. Okay, now it's my turn again. And this time, if I lose five lives, I'll hand it back over to you. Ooh, that's interesting. We went, like, up. Okay. Cortex power. Cortex power! Is that his, like, is that his, like rock album? Releasing later this year? What's a cut, this? A cutscene. Huh. That's... Interesting. It has been a long time since we had a forward stage. Yeah, when was the last time we had one? The bridge. Wow. I can't spin those things, right? I can't jump on them either. No, so. you have to avoid them. Oh gosh, my nose itches. Ah! Oh no. Okay. Oh gosh. I, I hated these stages so much as a kid. They were so scary. Okay. Whoa. What? Dang, this is... What? Oh. Wait, this is going to be invincibility. Yep. Which way should I go? Uh, look ahead a bit before you take it. Which way has boxes? Oh, it's not apparent. Well, we'll just go this way. Going right. Okay, right it is. Let's go. Is there anything here? Oh, boxes. Oh, that's it? Oh, I guess we just had to come here for that. Okay. The switch. I wonder what that did exactly, though. Oh, that was just bad luck. You heard the music, right? It was almost over. Well, still. Oh, oh what? Expect the other way. Okay. The first I mean, there might be boxes down there. We're likely gonna die. 
Okay. Ho, 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 ho. Okay. I really like these forward going stages, though. I tend to, like, be able to control them easier. Tend to. I said tend. I said tend. I covered my ass. It's fine. You, you can't compliment yourself while let's playing a game. It's a curse. Okay, what? I, I don't know what happened there. Was the perspective just messed up? Uh, probably. I think it's more up in the air. Yeah. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. Well, this isn't so bad. Why did that life just fall out of the air? It was in a box. I hit the enemy into it. And oh, it broke the box. Okay. Yeah. Alright, how do I handle this? Alright. Yeah, I like being able to take it a little a little slower. Okay. At least I can spin those, that's good. Alright, alright. Oops, well that's okay. Why would you spin dash into an ammo box? Oh. I beat the stage. That's good, right? Yeah, but completing this place is gonna be a bitch. Yeah, I know. But they won't. The, the viewers won't know that. Why does it matter to them? Uh, generator room. I'll let you handle pinstripe. Cause I know that you wanna. That face. That face has haunted me for so many years from this game. Cause you know all the stupid crap that bothers you as a kid. You know the stupid stuff that shouldn't yeah. be scary. Ugh. What is, what's the most unscary thing that scared you as a kid? Uh, the wizard from Crystal's Ponytail. What? That, that thing? It was, it was scary. <laughs> he would show up and he would teleport all over the place and the music would change. You didn't know whether or not you were really hurting him. God, that, that's on our future playlist at some point, too, right? Oh, yeah, it's on my list. Okay. Don't ask me how I did that. Okay. This one's interesting, because it kind of goes back and forth between two... It, see, I'm so confused about the whole continuing thing. Because, like, if I continue from the start of the stage, do I still get a chance for the box boxes? Yes. Okay. All right. As long as you get all of the boxes, I think you can still get the gem. Whether or not you've died. It's just if you die with a checkpoint box and you're unable to go backwards, then you're screwed. Okay, come on. But I haven't tested it. It'll, it'll come back. Yeah, I know, I know. Okay. Checkpoint? No, this is Tana. Tana box. Checkpoints have the C's. Yeah. Ooh. So um, I think we have to go right first. Okay, yeah. Shit. It's okay, it's okay. Well, what, is there anything up there? I don't think there is. Oh, oh. Oh, that was... That was weird. I did not think they would... Wow. Why? Because <laughs> it's 2D and 3D, okay? 2D and 3D. There's got to be a way. Okay. This is the last time. I believe in myself. I can do this. I can do this. I can't do this. You may have the controller now. Unbelievable, dude. My sad life. It's a failure. You know, can we just play Rocket Knight or something? I can beat Rocket Knight. <laughs> How about Rystar? <laughs> no way. Rystar is one of my high subscriber milestones. Yeah, you can just jump through. It's not that hard. Yeah, there you go. Oh, Neocortex. I beat a stage, though, so come on. Feel good. Feel good for me. You did the same thing. That's closer than it looks. <laughs> I can probably just step onto it. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're probably better off just stepping onto it and then just, yeah. Oh, gosh, T. Oh, oh. Seriously, is it like 85 degrees today? What the heck? Oh. Why do humans have to give up body heat? Why can't we give up body coldness? 
Well, we can. We just gotta be really evil. Seriously. Surroundings closing in. Okay, so you know to grab the boxes. Oh, you're gonna do that ahead of time? Okay. Yeah, I mean, the steel boxes are here. I mean, if I'm gonna fail, I'm gonna fail. Yeah, I guess. Why that's put a good it point. off? Well, that's why. Head back. Just head I back. I know, I know. Okay. You don't need all those fruits, man. There. Checkpoint. <sighs> no death yet. Without continuing. Tana! Tana. Tana looks so much like a Looney Tunes character. Oh, well, there we go. So much for that. <sighs> We expected this to happen, it's fine. It is fine. That's why I got so many lives. <laughs> oh, gosh. Yeah, it looks like this is actually probably gonna have to be the uh, last stage of the episode, too. That's, uh... Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Wow, we, we really were failures today, weren't we? Well, we beat a boss. That's pretty good. Maybe we'll get pinstripe in the next episode. Pathetic, stupid... Embarrassing. Oh, what the heck? I thought it was in front of this platform. So did I, but, you know, the perspective in this game. If, if only L1 and R1 just let you rotate the camera a teeny bit. You know? Yeah, but most of the textures in this game are probably just one-sided, so like it would break the illusion. I mean, that's the power of these... Wait, what? Oh, okay. That's the power of these, like, set camera games. It's like you... Do you know how little how little work you actually can kind of have to do? You just you can cheat on so many things. I did learn also today, um, like why, like it's so hard for player models in video games to like hold things. It's because uh, when when they make a model and they animate it, they have to compress that data when the game is like put on a disc or you know just compacted together to be more re easily read and when that compression happens it causes small inconsistencies between it and what it's doing that's why it's so hard to see fluently when it's holding something because they're two separate models trying to with two compressed datas well, they're trying to i knew that they were separate models yeah that's why if a model is part of something it's easier <sighs> Don't worry, you learned something, right? That's good. You came out of that a better person, with more knowledge in your head. Oh my god. What? I'm trying to be I'm trying to do good things here. I'm trying to help the world. With my vast knowledge of things. Like, uh, did you know Jurassic Park was originally uh, intended to be made with uh, stop motion animation? Yes. Jim Henson was behind it. Okay. <laughs> oh, boy. God, where am I going? Where is it taking me? Into the darkness. Which I assume you were supposed to be attacking. I don't have the spells for this. I need a cleric. Why is no one why is no one doing that joke? I gotta do that joke. What joke? No, I was thinking of like, you know, the I need an adult joke. You know that joke, right? Like yeah. but like with a cleric. Like, I need a cleric. I am a cleric. <laughs> That'd be great. Oh god. People would turn that into a like a Christian thing though. Like, <laughs> I need a priest. I am a priest. <laughs> Well, you and me both know that there's a difference between a priest and a cleric. I mean, priests are badass warrior. Uh, well, no clerics. No clerics. Or yeah, badass like warrior. It's really like Templars, I guess, in a way. What really differentiates a Templar from a 
cleric? Yeah. I don't know. Hopefully I'm not being too distracting. Oh wow. Oh there's the there's the Oh! 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 oh. oh. What the heck's a potteru anyway? Potterati. Potterati? Well, there we go. I guess uh we'll have to leave. I assume it's some kind of Australian red. Is the next fight with Pinstripe already? Are we actually already there? No, okay, well, no, no, we're not there yet. Toxic okay. waste. Oh, he's up in that room up there. Okay. Okay, so I guess that's it. No, we still have at least three more bosses to go in this game. Do we? Yeah, because we still have Pinstripe, and Brio, and End Cortex. Okay. Yeah, but that's all for this part. We're going to be rolling right into the fourth part, though, so... Thank you all so very much for watching. If you like this episode, leave a like and a comment. We're still just starting out, and likes and comments mean a lot to us. If you want to be notified when we upload more videos, subscribe when you will. And if you want to support us on Patreon, there'll be an end code at the end of the video, and a link in the description be below. It's funky. It's a nice song. So, we'll see you all in the next video. All I thought of is the name, and I don't play instruments or sing. Well, do you think we'll be popular? Uh, no. <laughs> oh, oh, poor onion son. <laughs>